Steve Perry is talking about touring, and we'll talk about that and some more stuff coming right up. It's Gary Stuckey. Welcome back to another episode where we're talking about Steve Perry and Journey and all that good stuff. And Steve Perry was on the radio for an interview this morning on Fun 101.7 in Fort Wayne, Indiana, uh, via the telephone or cell phone, whatever you call it. Uh, anyway, he was talking about different things. He was pretty funny this morning, uh, talking about that his mom... Uh, was a dancer and he said he can't dance but he can move he said that's funny stuff anyway uh he was mentioning uh touring and uh they asked him about that and uh he was talking about you know after the album is out uh then they'll start focusing on that you know i think steve is really wanting to focus on the music he don't want to get ahead of himself you know and a lot of people are and i know i'm guilty too uh of, of speculating but i'm not pressuring steve you know and saying if if i was blessed to get an interview i would not ask him all these questions that you know don't really pertain to his solo stuff you know but he's uh mentioning the uh tour um and talks like it will be after the album is released you know once the album is released i think things are going to really start taking off of course that album traces due out october 5th and then the interview on cbs i think that's really going to start everything you know into motion is that interview you know and then of course the album release um they're going to start focusing on things i'm sure they're working on the music right now uh but i'm thinking uh about the tour and i've said before it'd be cool if lou graham steve perry and lou graham that would be cool uh or some other people uh similar to that uh he may go out and get somebody up and coming singer to open up for him help them out you know nothing major probably smaller venues I'm thinking I'm thinking probably like uh, his last solo tour uh, for the love of strange medicine remember that when he did some shows I think it's gonna be something similar to that but I think they're gonna weigh out everything and see how popular this album is I mean if they sell out all these shows he may want to you know boost you know some things and uh, go to some bigger venues or something or add some more tour dates or something like that but what I was thinking, though, is, see, next year, in 2019, it will be the 35th anniversary of Steve's first solo album, Street Talk, and the 25th anniversary of his second solo album, For the Love of Strange Medicine. Wow. So 35-year anniversary, 25-year anniversary next year. And I think it was in April uh, 1984. For the love of strange menace i mean uh excuse me the uh street talk there we go that's the right one uh it was it was april 1984 for street talk and i think uh for the love of strange medicine was uh I'm trying to think was it like i think it was july the end of july but you can look that up i don't have it all right here uh but so i'm thinking around april or an, uh 35th anniversary type thing i'm sure there's gonna be something major happening there you know it would make sense to me uh so we'll be looking for you know for that and steve perry's songs out right now no erasing which has been on the charts on the adult contemporary charts and uh the other song he just released last week called no more crying very awesome song and powerful lyrics and some r b and bluesy, soulful type uh, music to go with it. And also, uh, S Steve Perry, he's got, you know, a lot of stuff coming up, so be on the lookout for that. And also, I want to talk about Neil Sean, who I was checking out over on Twitter last night, and Neil Sean's got a new um, YouTube channel. The Neil Sean YouTube channel and a new blog with Google+. 
And, uh, you know, just starting out, not a whole lot of followers just yet, but he just started it. It's pretty cool. He's got the guitar solos from uh, his tour so far this year. Uh, and some other interviews with uh, Sammy Hager over on the uh, blog and uh, stuff like that. So, uh, pretty cool. You know, videos that uh, his wife, Mikhail, has been taking. And uh, it looks pretty interesting. A lot of cool stuff. A lot of interviews over on his blog that... Uh, he's been doing and along with the Steve Perry uh, where he talks about Steve Perry and some of the interviews stuff like that you know and pretty interesting so go check that out Neil Sean YouTube channel but anyway Steve Perry new album October 5th called Traces and a tour is looming it's coming and I'm going doggone it hey don't stop believing everybody God bless you